The Mitten brings as, as, as a conduit of just kindness and community. I wanted to be a part of that. I saw what you guys had been doing even previous to the foundation being open and we were a part of every event that we could possibly be a part of and making sure our friends were coming as well. Knowing that we were making a difference on the west side and for the greater of the communities. What really drew me to the Mitten Foundation and knowing that they were true to their work. I could see that Max and Chris and yourself were very, like, this is our heart, this is our passion. We're doing this, you know, whether people like it or not, we want to, to do this. And they're tied to the West Side as well, and, and their passion for it is really what, what gets me in. Kathy and I, my wife, we, we've told our children for years, leave this world better than when you got here. So make a difference in this world. Don't just be here and waste it. And so knowing some of the board members that were already going to be on the board, I couldn't wait to say yes. I was very excited and honored to be asked. I kind of started off at the Mitten as just a server bartender and became friends with Chris and Max. And I saw how passionate they are for charitable giving. And when somebody's so passionate about wanting to help people, it's, it's contagious. That's what I wanted to do. I wanted to help people. So getting into the foundation, it was easy. How do you say no to wanting to help people? Well, I heard about the Mitten Foundation first because I'm a shareholder in the Mitten. The part that really got me is that the foundation is focusing efforts on the west side. Being a business that has the mind to make a difference in the community also brings people to the business because they have a heart. And having that heart for the community is shown. The school uniforms that we help purchase for Harrison Park, just knowing that if they're coming in with a new set of clothes, something fresh, you can see the pride. They're walking up straighter, they're smiling, they're opening their eyes more, they're more engaged with their classmates. When you see a kid do that, they're wanting to be at school more, learning's going to be taking place, and it's just an exciting time for them. And as a teacher, just seeing the smile on the kid's face, knowing that just something as simple as a t-shirt or a pair of pants or a, a shirt with a collar on it makes for them. It just makes my day so much better too. You guys have just been such a great partner and I think having people take care of their own communities is something that I don't think that that idea has maybe caught on yet. But to have somebody, you know, come to have you guys come with a plan and just say, hey, we want to take care of like our people. These are these are our people, you know, they're not some, you know, person that, you know, you see in a, a newsletter or something. It's like you live in it every single day. While everybody should be doing some form of thoughtful giving and charitable giving, being involved with your community is something that I hope that this program, this foundation, and the work that we do, I hope it inspires people around us.